welcome or welcome back to Beauty with Bella. If you guys are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are not new, welcome back. Either way, I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch my channel. If you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button, hitting the notification bell next to it so you'll be notified whenever I upload videos, and giving this video a thumbs up. I am Bella and on this channel I talk about beauty, mostly fragrances, and today guys I thought I would give you my favorites for the month of June. It's not just perfume because there's more to me than perfume. So if you guys are interested in hearing what I have to say, or you just want to spend time with moi, keep on watching. Okay, so guys I have some of my favorites that I have been loving in the month of June or before like this is some of this stuff is just like my rider dies and I thought I would just share it with you guys okay so the first thing I'm gonna share with you guys is how I moisturize my skin and mostly what I use actually what I've been using the majority of the time is this uh, CVS's version of CeraVe CeraVe skin cream oh my gosh y'all this keeps my skin so freaking amazing let me tell y'all something if y'all don't know anything about me i'm a beauty on a budget type chick okay i'm beauty on a budget so i might buy the cvs walgreens walmart target brand of stuff that's what i do and guess what y'all my skin feels amazing it feels soft it feels smooth you can get this buy one get one for 40 percent and if you don't believe that i love this so much there is hardly nothing in here this stuff works so well. I feel absolutely amazing. It's a creamy consistency, kind of thick. I don't know if you guys can see that, but um, it works so good. Keeps my skin so soft, not too heavy. I love it. This is their version of CeraVe's um, moisturizing cream. Love it. Next thing, guys, I'm going to move on to is this product has been hyped up a lot. If you guys are on any type of social media platform, you have seen this product, you have seen it advertised on TV. My friend told me it was great, I decided to get it. I am talking about Lumi deodorant. Yes, y'all, I brought the Lumi deodorant. Does it work as good as it said it that it works? Yes, it does. It works fantastic. Like. I usually use Dove deodorant and um, the only thing I didn't like about Dove was that it just when I just had a hard time washing that stuff off I had a very hard time washing it off it just felt like there was some kind of something left underneath my arms this is not that way this is also it's aluminum free it's baking soda free I don't know if you guys can see this but it's a very like creamy silky type consistency and um, you can use it under your arms you can use it on other parts of your body and it works very well now they say that you're supposed to go 72 hours odor free see that on the bottom I'm not making it up it's not true at least not for me I tried it and the next day I'm out in the streets I can smell myself not in a good way so um, for me personally, it doesn't work like 72 hours odor, uh, no odor. But besides that, I really love this. I will also say about Lumi deodorant is that this unscented has a scent that I don't like. It, I can actually smell something. It doesn't last that long, but you still smell something. And it's, I'm not a fan of the smell, but... Um, this works good as you can see you can put it under your arms you can put it in any other place I've used it like in other places of my body that I normally smell older after I exercise and I did not smell anything after I exercised. like this works really good it was worth the money I got both of these for $20 they have specials on their website I'll link their website down below check them out I think that you guys will like it Lumi deodorant Okay, next thing guys, my face. I can't feel my face cause I'm, when I'm with you, I know the words, but anyway, my face. What do I use to clean my face with? Well, these are things that I've been actually cleaning my face with and I love it. The first one is the First Aid Face Cleaner. 
Y'all, this stuff works so good. And I brought it on a whim. It's so silky. I don't know if you can see that, but it is a very silky feeling fragrance. It cleans my fragrance. I'm used to talking about perfume, but it cleans my face very, very well. I really love this. This, I got this from Ulta for $10. Once I run out of this, I'm gonna buy the bigger size. When I wear makeup, guys, I use um, the Pharmacy Green Clean uh, Cleansing Balm to take this off my makeup. Y'all, I'm not playing no games with this. You see how this is almost empty? This works so well. Like, it literally melts into your skin and takes off all of your makeup. I love this so much. It comes with this little spatula thing that you can scoop it out with. It cleans my face very well. My taking off makeup has never been easier for me. Love this. This is, um, the they have a, a smaller size that's $24, like a travel size. Or you can get this size, which I believe is $39 from Ulta. And I'm definitely gonna link everything for you guys down below. So, after my face is clean, what I put on my face is the much talked about Paula's Choice, this BHA uh, toner, liquid toner, exfoliant, excuse me. Y'all, this stuff works so good. Like, I'm not even lying. I don't get paid to say any of this. Nobody sponsored me. They don't know about me yet, but they will. Anyway, this stuff works absolutely amazing. Since I have been using this stuff, I have not had a lot of adult acne. My complexion looks clear. My kids have complimented me on how great my face looks. This stuff has really made a difference in my skincare and I am a huge fan of this. You can start off with buying the smaller travel size for $10 or you can get this for $29. This is just absolutely great. And then after uh, I put this on my face, about three times a week, I use the Saturday Skin Sleep Mask. This stuff works really good. My skin is brighter. I noticeably, noticeably see a difference in my complexion. The only thing I would say might throw people off is it has a jelly type consistency. I don't know if you guys can see that. So it feels wet when you put it on your skin, but once it dries, you're good to go. And I use this between three and four times a week. I really do love this. I truly feel it has made a difference. This is the Saturday Skin Yuza Vitamin C Sleep Mask. And I believe it's $36 on Ulta's, not Ulta. Sephora's website. Okay, y'all. So now that I've gotten my cleansing out the way, I just wanted to show you guys a couple of the skincare products I use on my skin, on my face. So before I talk about that, y'all, this Stella Rosa Berry is off the chain. If you like to drink wine, you will love this. Please excuse me, but this tastes so good. Okay, back to the video. Lancome's Skin Feels So Good Skin Tint. Y'all, I've used plenty of skin tints in my life, including Fenty Skin Tint, which I have. This stuff is the best. I'm, I promise you, for me, I love it. I absolutely love it. It has hyaluronic acid. It has some uh, antioxidants. This feels like silk going on my face. They have 15 shades of this. You can get it from Ulta or Sephora for about $39. This stuff is love. And it has SPF 23 in it. You can wear it with or without makeup. I have this on right now with my Bare Minerals Face, uh, the powder foundation. This stuff is absolutely gorgeous it feels beautiful on your skin you can't go wrong if you haven't tried it please give it a try I think that you will like it okay when I don't wear that one for SPF purposes I use the super goo super goop glow screen because 
Y'all, I like to glow. I really do. I like to glow in the summertime. I like to have some kind of popping highlights. So this is great. And it has SPF 40. You can wear this with or without makeup. You don't need a whole lot. I made a mistake of putting too much on my face and it definitely shows you don't need a whole lot. This stuff is great and it also doubles as a primer. So when I wear this and I put on foundation, I don't have to put a primer on because this stuff works really well. This is super goop and I think it's like $36 or $39 on Sephora's website. Okay y'all, speaking of primer, I watched Kyra Knox who's having a baby. She, Her and her husband are so cute. And I was watching her get ready and she was using this milk um, blurring, the blur stick. And it's supposed to blur out your pores and all of that stuff. I decided to buy it because her makeup is always flawless. And I really love this. I love it. I love how it looks on my face. It kind of gives it like a little glow. Again, I like to glow. I. I do. I love to wear makeup though, but this stuff, guys, it is so good. I'm so happy I brought it. They have the travel size for $18 or this size for $36. If you like to have a little um, glow to your skin and you want to like blur out your pores, I think you should try this. You might like it. This is really good. I love, love, love this. Okay, y'all. Last thing for makeup is the nude medium eyeshadow palette by Huda Beauty. I've been trying to do like no makeup makeup looks, mostly neutral, and I really like this. And because I have all this stuff on my skin, I'm having a hard time opening it from, okay, got it. This is what the eyeshadow palette looks like. Look at all those gorgeous neutral colors. They have some mattes, they have some shimmers. If you have not tried this, you should. I went to DC and I took this with me and this is all that I needed. I didn't need any other eyeshadow palette because it's neutral and it can just go with anything. I think that you, if you guys like this, you should try it. It comes in three uh, shades, light, medium, and dark. I have the color medium. This is great. It retails for about $29 on Sephora's website. Now that we've gotten the skincare products out the way, and I've had another sip of wine, a favorites video without, would not be a favorites video for me without talking about fragrances. So these fragrances, guys, these three fragrances, I have been using more than any other uh, perfumes I have in my collection, and I have a lot. That says a lot. That means I really love these. Like, I've been like reaching for these and I'm gonna go in order of how I've been reaching for them. The first one is Angel Corsier 2020. I brought this when it was cooler outside, so I couldn't really appreciate it the way I wanted to. I decided to grab for it, and y'all, oh my gosh. It smells so good. It's, I love the fig in the opening. It's just, it smells so good. It has praline in it. It feels like it's coconutty to me, but there's no coconut in here. It's a tropical smelling scent. It's sweet, it's fruity, it's creamy. I'll put the notes up for you guys. This smells amazing and it's affordable. I got it off of uh, fragrancenet.com, I think. If you don't have it, guys, you should really try this. Angel Crossier 2020, Terry Mugler. He did an amazing job. Love this fragrance. Okay, y'all, the next thing I have been love this fragrance, I slept on it. I slept on it. I was being kind of rebellious with it. All last year, I heard people talking about this, and I was like, I don't want to buy it. I, sometimes I do that when I hear, like, fragrances are really hyped up. I'm just like, ah, I don't want it. But one day, I decided to drink the Kool-Aid, and when I did, oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh. You know what, y'all? You know how you buy things and it just kind of sits there? That's what happened. I brought this. I used it a couple of times, but I, I didn't really pay attention to it. But one day I wore it and I was like, oh my God, this is great. And I'm talking about YSL Lib or Libre, um, the auto parfum. Y'all, my good Lord. 
my goodness this has everything it's it's, it's everything it's, it's everything the lavender just really gets me I love lavender I don't know why it took so long to buy it it has lavender in it and it has vanilla I think it has some musk in here this smells so good if you like lavender you will love this I feel like this could be one of those everyday all year round signature scents this could be my signature scent if I didn't have so many bottles of perfume I love how this smells it is absolutely gorgeous and when I wear it I also put the Bath and Body Works aromatherapy the sleep vanilla and lavender together BAM I'm just telling I'm just telling the truth if they go perfect together perfect perfect so if you have not tried it you should try it and use this with it you're gonna love it I, I promise you you're gonna love it this last one guys oh, it's my favorite like out of all the perfumes I have I have been reaching for this more than anything else and this is aliens sublime or sublime however you pronounce it and if you think I'm lying look at the dent I have not had this that long on I haven't and with all the perfumes I have that dent it says a lot oh my gosh this is gorgeous this is gorgeous of course it has the alien DNA but the citrus notes it has a lot of citrus notes I'm gonna link the notes for you guys but I want to say it has some lemon and some mandarin orange possibly some orange blossom of course it has jasmine and it has some heliotrope y'all this is just gorgeous and dare I say dare I say I think I like this better than the original alien I'm this is just like this is everything this will be another beautiful signature set if you did not like the original alien you can still give this a try because of the citrus notes it makes it zesty and fresh it's just like this is beautiful very very beautiful so if you haven't gotten your hands on it get your hands on it alien sublime or sublime however you pronounce it okay guys so there you have it those are the products that I have been loving in the month of June. Let me know in the comments down below, what are your favorite products this month? What are some things you love or some things that you think I should try? Y'all, I love hair, I love makeup, I love perfume. I'm just not all about the perfume. I'm just all about beauty in general. So let me know, let's talk about it in the comments down below. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel hit the notification bell, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and comment down below. Until we meet again, guys, stay safe, be blessed, remember you are beautiful, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.